Hello guys, this is Daniel and I'm back with another Pokemon Black and White 2 Wi-Fi Battle and today I actually bring you guys a PU battle and yeah, it's a quite old battle but that's the only thing I had for you guys today so I'm sorry about that but yeah, um, you might as well get this than nothing so my team consists of a Spex, Exploud, a Scarf Mix, Raichu, Mixed Life Orb Dragonair, Badden Lairon, um, Bulky Golbat and also Bulky Leafeon so he and his team, um, yeah, I don't really understand much of PU, so I don't know what to say, so yeah, without further ado, let's just go straight into the battle. So, I'm gonna decide to lead off with my x Plow because I'm Specs, I can do lots of damages on the first turn, and my opponent is gonna decide to lead off with Chingling, or what the hell the name of that thing is, I don't even know, but he happens to switch onto Shield on on the first turn because... Yeah, maybe he was predicting the hyper voice exactly, but I just went for it because I didn't really want to over predict on the first turn, so I don't know what that thing wants to do also, so I do go into my leaf you want to take any hit you would like to throw at me, but he has to go for the stealth rocks and I do run him out into his Blossom, but I do actually decide to toxic that thing because I know that thing is really bulky on the special side and I know that I cannot touch it with leaf you want, so yeah, he misses the sleep powder, I'm sorry about that, but there's nothing we can do, so I do switch again onto my Dragonair, thinking he would do away for the Sleep Powder, and I do have the Shed Skin, but he happens to go for the Sludge Bomb, trying to get the damage on my Leafeon, but he actually does quite a lot into my Dragonair, and he goes again onto the Shield on, I predict that really nicely, it was really obvious, so I just go straight for the um, Surf, because I am mixed, like I said before, and two Surfs is definitely gonna be able to take out the Shield on, so that's cool for me, and yeah, Shield is out of the way. So he goes on to his Volbeat and I didn't really knew that this thing got an Ice type hit and I yeah I actually majorly didn't know what the thing would like to do again so I just let that thing die so I do bring in Raichu and I know that the Thunderbolt is really obvious and I know that's gonna bring in the Blossom but actually HP Ice was a win-win situation because it will also be affected on, on Volbeat but HP Ice is super effective on Blossom and does nothing so yeah, that's Velocity for you guys, that's why you always use that thing in Yanyu, because it's really cool, and it's cute, like you can see. But he misses another Sleep Powder, so that Velocity is kind of blind today. <laughs> Maybe if that thing needs glasses, I don't know. But, yeah, Toxic is really into it, the thing, and... Yeah, kind of getting the leftovers every turn, and... He goes for the Sludge Bomb this time, does lots of damages onto my Leafeon, because I'm majorly defensive on the defensive side, not on the special side, so... Yeah, I do run him out into the Seeking, and Seeking goes straight for the Ice Beam, and for some reason I thought Seeking was a physical attacker, but I think he's a special attacker with Life Orb, so that's cool. Um, do bring in later on because I know that I have the, um, yeah, I don't know, Rock Head? I don't know. But I don't have Sturdy, which is interesting because I think I made that thing being Sturdy, I don't know. Maybe I made that thing being Rock Head. I don't know, but I'm um, going to my x go for the Hyper Voice and do, um, yeah, kill that thing at least, and I do, and he goes again onto the Shingling thing, and Hyper Voice again, and I'm gonna get a critical hit, and again, I am sorry, I kind of x him out a little bit this battle, but yeah, I think it paid off for me not knowing later on, and not knowing the pokes, I think, so, oh, actually it doesn't, but... Um, go for the Brick Break on my x Cloud. I just stay in and go for the Hyper Voice to see how much it would do to the Volbeat and it kind of fails on the KO, so yeah, but this is on a range that anything will kill that thing, so I do go into Golpet on the predicted Brick Break, so that does literally nothing and he doesn't really want to um, stay in and let that thing die just yet, so he goes on to the Blossom again, but I'm not really too worried about that because I do have the Brave Bird on my moveset. And yeah, Blossom, like I said, is majorly, especially defensive, not defensive, so Brave Bird is, should knock Blossom out from that range, and it does, which is really nice, because yeah, Blossom is now out of the way. And again, the Noble thing, um, I don't really want to, I don't know what Noble wants to do, but I actually went for a Tarn predicting the Stealth Rocks, late game Stealth Rocks, I don't even know. No, I guess he already has Stealth Rocks, though. No, so, yeah, X that, um, I'm dumb, so goes for the rock slide and kind of negated the curse there and I just keep on going for the brave bird because I want to get as much time as, as I can on the noble and yeah now I do go for the roost because I could negate my flying type and rock slide would not be able to do much but he opts to go onto the full beats but that's fine by me because now Golbat kills everything left so 
And Ice Punch is absolutely, it's not, yeah, it's gonna do nothing to my Golbat, I'm sorry, but yeah, Brave Bird is definitely gonna be able to kill the Volpeat and the same to Nummel because Nummel is on the range that Brave Bird is definitely gonna be able to kill, so yeah, that was the battle. Um, sorry for, um, yeah, me not knowing the pokes, but you know how PU is for me. And yeah, the attack of Leiron, I still cannot remember that freaking name, if anybody could tell me. The one which is a rock type hit, which ha usually has recoil, but rock heads negates it. Rock smash, yeah! No, not rock smash. Ed smash, yes, thank you. Yeah, alright. Ed smash, I think that's it. I Maybe I did put rock head on that thing because of bandit Ed smash to do lots of damages and no recoil, but... I actually thought that there that um yeah I did had sturdy and I could have been able to take the hydro pump and go for the rock head and kill the sea king but no I didn't so and that's life but yeah if you didn't check out last video please go check that thing out also check out my LPs that's on my channel black two randomizer nuzlocke and blue randomizer nuzlocke and yeah that's basically it so yeah until next time later.